Hello everyone, welcome to our channel. In this video, we are going to talk about the division of numbers. So in this example, we are dividing 84 by 6. So how many times does 6 goes to 8? So 6 times 1 is 6. Now subtract 6 from 8, the remainder is 2. Now we cannot divide 2 by 6, so we will bring down the 4 near 2, which becomes 24. Now how many times does 6 goes to 24? So 6 times 4 is 24. Subtract 24 from 24, the remainder is 0. Whenever we are dividing 84 by 6, the answer will be 14. So we can say that 84 divided by 6 is equal to 14. Now here is another example and we are dividing 585 by 3. So how many times does 3 goes to 5? So 3 times 1 is 3, subtract the 3 from the 5, the remainder is 2. Now we cannot divide 2 by 3, so bring down the 8 near 2, which becomes 28. Now how many times does 3 goes to 28? So 3 times 9 is 27. Subtract 27 from 28, the remainder is 1. Now again we cannot divide 1 by 3, so we will bring down the 5 near 1 which become 15. Now how many times does 3 goes to 15? So we can say that 3 times 5 is 15. Subtract 15 from 15, the remainder is 0. So we can say that 585 divided by 3 is equal to 195 or we can say that 585 divided by 3 is equal to 195. Now here is another example and we are dividing a 4 digit number by a 1 digit number just like we are dividing 1816 divided by 4. So here we see that just like we divided the first digit by the divisor, in this example we cannot divide the first digit by 4. So we will combine the one, the first digit and the second digit and make it 18. 1 and 8 becomes 18. Now we can divide 18 by 4. So how many times does 4 goes to 18? So 4 times 4 is 16. Subtract 16 from 18, the remainder is 2. Now we cannot divide 2 by 4, so we will bring down the 1 near 2, which becomes 21. Now we can divide 21 by 4, so how many times does 4 goes to 21? So 4 times 5 is 20. Subtract 20 from 21, the remainder is 1. Now again we cannot divide 1 by 4, so we will bring down the 6 near 1, which becomes 16. No think that how many times does 4 goes to 16? So 4 times 4 is 16. Subtract 16 from 16, the remainder is 0. So we can say that the answer is 1816 divided by 4 is equal to 454. Now here is another example in which we are dividing a 4 digit number by a 1 digit number just like we are dividing 24,000. 836 divided by 2. So assume that how many times does 2 goes to 2? So 2 times 1 is 2. Subtract the 2 from the 2, the remainder is 0. Bring down the 4 near 0. So here we see that how many times does 2 goes to 4? So 2 times 2 is 4. Subtract the 4 from the 4, the remainder is 0. Now we will bring down the 8 near 0 which become 8. So how many times does 2 goes to 8? So 2 times 4 is 8. Subtract the 8 from the 8, the remainder is 0. Now again we see that there are 36 as remain. So bring down the 3 near the 0 which become 3. So how many times does 2 goes to 3? So 2 times 1 is 2 subtract the 2 from 3 the remainder is 1 now we will bring down the 6 near the 1 which becomes 16 
so how many times does 2 goes to 16 so 2 times 8 is 16 subtract the 16 from the 16 the remainder is 0 so we can say that whenever we are dividing 4836 by 2 the answer will be 12818 or simply we can say that 24836 divided by 2 is equal to 12818 we will if you have liked the video subscribe to our youtube channel for more such interesting videos